Today is a really exciting day. It's a milestone for MSL in the sense that the first time we're seeing the rover drive on its own wheels, uh, its own mobility system. It's gone from designs on napkins to PowerPoint, you know, to uh, CAD drawings, to blueprints, and now it's a rover. This is really one of the big milestones. Uh, you know, we've been all designing various parts of the rover in, in different places at JPL, different places around the world, and now to see them come together and to see a rover sitting in front of us and actually have somebody press a button and it drives, you know, this really gives us a vision of, of this rover's real and it's going to be on Mars someday. It's going to explore a big area on Mars. That's one of the reasons it's so big and has such a great driving capability. We wanted to ba basically drive it around 10 or 20 miles around the landing site on Mars and look for places that may have been habitable early in Mars history, places that were friendly to life. I've seen pictures of this rover for so many years, you know, I, kn I know it in my sleep, but yet to see it like real life and to know that this is the actual thing that's going to Mars and will drive around over rocks and soil and, and you know, go down into craters, uh, that's, that's kind of amazing. It sort of blows your mind to, to look at this thing and see, uh, see something that's going to be on Mars one day.